Good morning, good morning, happy Sunday. Hope everyone's doing fantastic. I sure am. It's cozy Sunday. We're gonna start that up. We're just chilling in the t-shirt and some shorts today. I think once it gets a little cooler out, we'll start switching over into some nice sweats and, and more comfy looking clothes, but uh, for now we're just doing rocking the t-shirt. I know we always rock the fancy clothes, but Sundays are gonna be our chill day. Boyo! Thank you for the resub, 11 months. You've been staying strong since the beginning. I appreciate it. Since the beginning. That's crazy. Uh, but we're going to get into Cyberpunk today. Get back to that. Uh, I think you were one of the few people that could rock the, uh, the gold chocobo. But you have the you have the founder thing, so that's good too. Um, but yeah, back to Cyberpunk. This game is so good. The last time we played was so much fun. Uh, it's it's gonna get so good, and then like the combat feels so smooth. I'm enjoying it so much. We got a couple more things set up finally for the background. Um, we got this really cool Final Fantasy XIV poster that came with the chair. So we, we got that set up in a frame uh, in the back there. Um, I finally got the mic up on a shelf so it's out of the way and stable. So hopefully that's good and it, it, it doesn't give me any more issues. Um, yeah, all, the last thing we're waiting for is just shelves for the back. and then And then we'll have a nice setup. So that's exciting. Let's uh let's hop over into the game. Oh, I also set up um whatchamacallit? The uh you can spend some VV biscuits to change the color of the background now. I don't have it set so it just automatically does it, but uh But I'll I'll just pay attention if people do it. So we can do that, we can do rainbow. I like this thing. It's kind of kind of cool. I wasn't ever a big RBG person, but it's it's all right. It, it makes for some some cool dynamic changes to your background. Um, but yeah, let's get into the game. No more no more messing around. But howdy, that howdy, Night City. Welcome back. My guest tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the NCPD. Hi there, welcome to the show. Okay, and where, Hi, we, where we left Thanks off to... I hope you made it to the studio without any issues. No carjackings or drive um, along the way. It was crazy. <laughs> no, no. Uh, fortunately, the streets of Night City are getting safer every day. We've seen recorded homicides drop from 7,103 a year ago to just... Uh, hold on, hold on. The streets are safe, you say, but what about the highways? Yeah, I don't know about that. Just, <laughs> the streets have not been safe. We got we got in our car like immediately after one quest and got sh got hunted down like like nothing. All right, what do we gotta do? Yeah, the ending that we got through the last time was nuts. We got we got killed. Uh, got brought back to life because of the chip in our head. And then now we have Johnny Silverhand like trying to take over our body. It's crazy. It was a wild ending. These are the things that um, what's his name gave us? Vic? He said he gave us some new clothes. Let's see. Well, that's... That's intense. Yeah, we got all these jackets now. They're kind of sick. What is that? Shiny gold? Oh, man. The outfits are sick in this game. They like 
really feel cyberpunky. <laughs> it's a good way to explain it. We also have the uh, the freaking Witcher one, which is awesome. I don't think we're gonna rock that. I think honestly, this was my favorite. The, like open top. Oh, we got some gym shorts. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna rock the gym shorts. I like the chucks too. Leather boots. Ooh, I kind of like that. That looks good. Got a baseball cap. That's that's gonna be a no for me. That's gonna be a no for me. No baseball cap. I think that looks pretty good. This is our bash, right? We can change our loadout. The his submachine gun was actually pretty sweet. Uh, I think we also need... Let's grab our katana too. Or well... Should we use the Gwyn blade? Is the... Um... The spec that we're going... Whoa, that is not what I wanted. Didn't I change my outfit? Yeah, okay. We're just not wearing clothes. Oh, we changed the outfit, not the actual stuff we were wearing. I don't think none of this gives buffs or anything yet. This is just for for style. We'll just throw what we actually have on. Leather boots? Nice. Okay. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, the, the submachine gun was awesome. Uh, so was the assault rifle. I like the... Um, the three shot one that we had. The three round burst. That's like my favorite kind of uh, assault rifle. It's what I used when I played... Uh, Call of Duty back in the day. All the time. What is, um... The Katana better? Damage per hit? Now we're using the Gwen Blade. That thing looks sweet. But I think swords are good for the... I haven't even, like, looked too much into what... We're going reflexes, but I think swords is good. Blades, I guess, is what they're called. Because I think we're going body play or body um, reflexes and tech was the plan. Because this will give us more grenade stuff, more healing stuff. Reflexes will be assault rifles and SMGs, and then this is just health. So that'll be good. Our tech is at 9 now. Health freak. 8% recharge. And then level 2 gives a plus 1 health item. That's pretty good. Recharge speed when only Yoan's used. Yeah, especially since we're playing on hard. I think having this stuff is going to be useful. Some, sometimes people are freaking hurt. Oh, we should also bump a perk up. Let's get our body up one. Check your email. Rent past due. Dear sir, madam, our record show, we've not received this month's rent. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, it looks like uh, emails in this game are just like 
Just like what you get in real life. It's just a bunch of spam. Just a bunch of worthless spam. <laughs> Takebura here. We must meet. Come to Tobu's diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. I haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Okay. So that guy still wants to work with us. Probably because he wants to get uh, back against... What's his name? Uh, El Capitan. Listen, cars are like underwear. I mean, you don't gotta change them every day, but it's better for everyone if you do. Got a few new sets on my net page. Oh, we can buy new cars. Bart Moss Collective. First will come the Great Reality Check with an Usher's. Best weapon against capitalism is uninterrupted mediation. Mega Building H10 Administration informs you that your vehicle is available for collection in a nearby parking garage. Okay. Go get our car. Dear Mr. V, I would like to inform you that Mr. Wells' body has been delivered to his family. Damn. Yeah, that's right. Jackie, Jackie uh, didn't make it. Coach Fred? A couple words about who you're going on. Oh, this is the boxing guy. Where we can do those street fights. It's kind of like, uh... Oh, and then Road Trace, that arcade game. It's kind of like the uh, same thing with um, The Witcher. Alright, what do we want to do? So we can go... We can go to talk to Takamura. Do you have a reward to correct, collect from uh, Wakaka? Oh, this is for the, the girl that we... Saved at the very beginning, I think. That we never got to pick up the reward for. Alright, well, let's go get our, our car. Oh, yeah, get out of here, yeah. You bot. Surprised I didn't get uh, blasted by the whatchamacallit. Maybe. Barry, we know oh, you're damn. in there. We're here to help. Don't got no fucking warrant. You know what the worst thing is about this place? This city just feels so alive. There's our boxing dude. Hey, B! Haven't seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Nope, just died. Just trouble, <laughs> usual stuff. Just, just passed away. In need of iron and lead, then, I think. Got our coffee for the morning too. Oh, that's good. Sunday mornings are fantastic. Show me what you got. Sure. Let me see what you we got. can also sell our, our junk because we probably aren't going to keep a bunch of these pistols and whatnot. Well, these cool ones maybe. Because they're named pistols, so we'll keep them. We'll hang on to them. That one's junk though. That was the chainsword. Oh man, and we can get rid of duplicates of this stuff too. Old camo, we have two of those. We have two of these now. Two of these cotton shirts. Two shorts.
Oh man, and then there's all the crafting you can do. You can make like all this stuff. We sell junk. Oh yeah, we have all that junk we pick up too. Free money. Oh we have we have twenty thousand dollars? Where did we get money from? What gave us so much money? We were poor. Dang. Look at that thing. The Gwyn Blade. I think our car's down here. Let's do that. Yeah. Go get our car. Oh, it feels so weird not wearing our... Our freaking vest and tie and everything. Now that I've been doing it for like two weeks. It's kind of nice having a comfy day though. Makes like my my week feel like a work week and then you get a chill on the weekend. Music is loud. Can we turn that down? <laughs> Holy moly. We have the uh, the copyright stuff turned off, but master volume. We already have it super low. Oh my god! It feels like it was just blasting me. Turn that down. Just to touch to you. Can I get out? Where the heck is my car? Oh, it's in this garage over here. Phoebe's being- what the- what the hell? Is that Delamain? <laughs> what the hell happened? Looks like everyone in this fucking town's out to end you. Makes me feel like an amateur. A hack. Ugh, shut up. Gotta find out why Night City's most courteous is upgraded to hit and runs. What the hell was that? Probably couldn't stand you anymore either. Alright, thanks. I said shut up. Thanks, Johnny. Well, that sucks. You just wrecked my car. Please accept our sincerest apologies regarding traffic incident number 77111-01096. The Dunlane Corporation cordially invites you to its main headquarters in order to assess damages and arrange compensation. Well, now we don't have a car. So that's lame. What the hell am I gonna do? Do we go talk to Takamura? The frick was that? <laughs> just got blasted by Delomain. I love this. I love being able to scan everyone and see what they have. I think that's cool. Daniel Banks. Like, you just scan everyone. The city feels so alive. Got hit by that car. Oh, there's Takamura. Sit. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. I was kind of surprised we both survived. 
Why'd you help me? Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This is about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it will be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. Yeah, Vic's the man. What do you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn, what's she to you? She and the Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You thinking I would have a word with her myself? She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Yeah, she probably skipped town. Just answer your own question. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? I don't know. I, she said There's she no could. Time to waste I don't think so, no. Can you expand? Don't matter how much perfume Macorpo sprays on mornings. By lunch, that's replaced by the stench of skullduggery. Only thing I caught from Evelyn was determination. And I too stink of skullduggery? No, nope. you're starting to stink. Period. <sighs> Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorino Murasaka yeah. must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. Okay, what do I get? <laughs> I like rewards. I like loot. I'm a loot goblin. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. I mean, that's fair. We could... It would be like proving that Yorinobu did it, so then they would help me. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. For money. It's always money. <laughs> you mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Oh, damn. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. What's that? It is a true honor to meet you. Oh, is that? Oh, that's the daughter. Fucking sucker scum. 
was everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. We don't. We don't need. One of you's got some fucking sense. Yeah, well, get out of here, man. But <laughs> we don't need to draw attention to ourselves. We're both uh, wanted. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind. That's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Hey, me too. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. I worked in the kitchen my entire life. Thanks for the offer. It's the time I was in high school. About it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Uh, we could try it. Well... I do want to find Evelyn. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Yorinobu Arasaka would agree. I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Well, he's got to be somewhere. You know more than I thought. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. Okay. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. Okay, so Rogue is that one chick that, like, is the, the best. There's no time to waste. The best of the best fixer. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo Sama's killer. Rogue's well informed. What? Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. Okay, so they're pinning it on him. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Damn. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Oh, hi. Thank you for joining. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. What? We buddies now? You know, you got some nerve. <laughs> First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. 
you know, you everyone's got to think we're crazy. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. I don't trust you. <laughs> Why should I trust you? Remind me again. <laughs> trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You can help me? You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't oh, man. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. Johnny's kind of like... <laughs> He's quick with his, his, his quirky. There is no us. Oh, he's freaking quick. Yeah, everyone's got to think we're super crazy, especially when we're the right away where we're just talking out loud, yelling for nothing. It's wild. Call Judy. Find Evelyn. Okay, let's. Um. Can't go out that way. Yeah, let's call. Well, we can't. We could try calling Evelyn, but let's call Judy. Lee? That you? Shit. Thought you were gone. So did I. You're not alone in thinking me dead. Thought it was game over for me too. Things went ass up, huh? Not as planned. You heard about the heist, I take it. Must have, uh, talked to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Old damn city's hurt. Her? She's just walking around half naked. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What'd I just say? Drop it. Damn. I won't tell you again. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? Hey, look. What? Oh, I was like, where are you? Ooh, interesting. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? You've gone completely whacked when I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? The one with the hair? The one with the hair? The one with the hair? Yeah, both. Weird. The graffiti's like glitching. Huh. Man, we have so many quests. This game is gonna be a lot, but I'm excited. Um, do we want to just continue this and go talk to Judy? Because that's. We wanted to get to Evelyn. Talk to Misty, talk to Victor about this. Well, I guess, oh, you know what? Maybe we should just go pay Victor too, because we have 26,000. We'll just go get that done too. Pay that man back for all of our crap. That's the Phantom Liberty quest, so we're not going to do that until way later. Um, yeah, let's do this. We'll go do that, and then we can pay Victor back. Since we're right here. Oh. 
Let's go. He's sleeping. He's not. Pre he's not preaching right now. Oh, here we go. I saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What it look like? I grab the scan. Take a look. Tarot, Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. What's that? <laughs> the what now? Major Arcanum? I don't know, Tarot. Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. Either way, you're saying some higher power is talking to me through tarot cards. Or to Silverhand. Or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. That's weird. Higher power could be a little clearer. You know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road. So go down it. Nope, not buying it. <laughs> don't trust it. Uh, what do I do? Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. All right. Oh, we can go talk to Victor too. Um, man. Also, yesterday, my partner and I did a couple of friends went to the first football game of the year, um, and it was it was a good time. Had fun. Um, we don't get to do stuff like that too often, so we like to take advantage when we can. And uh, but it was hot. It has been so hot lately uh, here in the Midwest, and. It, uh, it was hot and sunny, and man, if you got fair skin, like me, you're ginger, we, we forgot sunscreen, because we were just, like, trying to get going, and, like, we're excited, so I forgot, and I, um, you can't really tell too much, because my oh, face, no. my face wasn't as bad, but the back of my neck is pretty burnt. And we got home. I was playing games uh, last night, and my partner comes in and goes, "You need, you need Alan, <laughs> because I'm stubborn, and I'm, I'm not gonna put it on." So we got the Alan on, and man, sunburns are no joke. I think there was like something that's people would take sunburns a little bit more serious if they actually called them what they are, being radioactively burned. Usually we're pretty good about, I'm, I'm pretty good about doing sunscreen anymore because sunburns are, are no joke. But the game was fun. I'm not a huge, I used to be big, huge, huge into football. But, kind of like, I don't know, grew out of it. Now that I'm older, still enjoy it, but it's not. It's not the one thing I do all the time. Way more into video games than anymore. I like my peace at home. Listen, don't laugh, uh, but I've been seeing some weird shit around town. Like murals or something. But I know they're not real. Uh, just a Kuroshi blip. Could take a look. No, no. The images are too complex for a blip. It's like they're symbols. That case is the biochip. Brain can't handle the data overload. Either that, or it's reached the cortex. Uh -oh. Can you do anything? 
Well, better find a way to get rid of that ship. That doesn't sound good. Can I talk to you about the other thing, Vic? No? You don't want to talk anymore? Maybe if we leave. Finally scrounged up enough eddies to pay you back in full. Hold on to them just in case. You need them more than me. I'm not taking them all the way to my grave, Vic. You want to give me the money back? And okay. thanks again for doing so much work on me without ever seeing in any. That's what friends are for. I feel good about that. Vic's so good. He's a he's a cool character. Oh, we can do our implants and stuff now. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Have a look. Dang, dude, we can do so much stuff. This is like one of the coolest parts of this game. You get to like upgrade everything. Change how you play completely just by based off of this stuff? That's kind of crazy. Automatically connects to your... Okay, so that's tech. We aren't doing tech. Effective at scanning highlights explosive devices and traps. Huh. Sentry. Uh, highlights cameras and turrets. Plus 2% headshot damage. Plus 2 health. Oh, so it does the top thing, and then it also gives you a bonus. Weapon handling aim speed? Dang. That's cool. There's so much you can do. But then this is how much... So this is like your um, capacity. Indicates the amount of cyberware your body can handle. The limit increases as you level up, acquire certain perks, and use cyberware capacity shards. Okay. What's the skill? This is like armor. <clears throat> that gives more RAM. Carrying capacity plus armor minus movement speed. Dang. This is just straight up armor and damage resist. Titanium bones. We can be Wolverine. Well, we're kind of poor, so we can't really do a lot of this right now, but. Atomic sensors. So this is our nervous system. Increased movement speed, potential um, proportional to the enemy's detection of you outside of combat. That just makes you be able to get out of their vision faster. Plus movement speed when entering combat. That's kind of nice. Gives us explosive damage. Allows you to aim and perform attacks while sliding. That's really good. Uh, sliding, dodging, or dashing. Slows time by 60% when you... So then we would slide. It would slow down time. And you could take your pop shots then. That's really cool. That's just like if you're going blades. All melee. Man, a melee run would be fun in this. Hmm. Yeah, I think uh, this one seems pretty good. But you can get a ton. You can get so much stuff. Oh, we can get one of these. These aren't that much. Uh, increased sprint speed. Starting at plus 30%, tapering off to 10%. Okay. Melee and weapon handling. Quieter movement, crouch movement speed. So this is for stealth. You can double jump with this. And then this is a huge jump. Wow. Some of this stuff is nuts. Let's grab this for now. A 
bit more more movement speed. This game's crazy. The upgrades you can do. I'm sure that gets wild towards the end of the game. What's this guy got? Um. Oh, this is the car guy. I've always dreamed of living like a rock star, but still don't know how many strings. Okay, so he's just trying to sell his cars. Okay. What do we want to do? Keep busy while you wait for the car to be repaired. Okay. That'll just take time for the car to get fixed. I think we'll head to Judy. Let's do that. Seventy-five meters. How far is that actually? It's way over here. Oh, we can go. We can fast travel. Nice. I'll check it out. Is there a fast travel around here? Yeah. Now, please leave the area. Oh, maybe we should scan this. Forgot you gotta scan all of them before you can actually go back to them. Same as like, uh, The Witcher when you discover the signpost or whatever. Judy. Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Yeah. Got a good memory for faces. Are you always here? Bar's closed. Sorry, Chu. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. They just let me in. Just don't let me catch you messing around, okay? Whoa, whoa, start again. What is it you want us to do? Make some sense into him. That don't work. I don't know. Use lead. I, I don't care. I just want my room back. Your pimp threw you out, that it? Told me I was generating losses, then just said, have a nice life and slam the damn door. I don't got nowhere to sleep tonight. Still got your body though, don't you? Work it. Is that a quest? I do. Every any I make is eaten out of my own. Damn, everyone is just like out. Nothing to see back here. Lie. Judy's friend. Whatever. I was told I could come back here. Oh. You're done with that. Yep. Back to the Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all. I don't. You so Hello? concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. Yikes. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. <laughs> Is that Suze your boss? Know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? I'm just trying to be polite. Listen, 
Have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. She's the one that wanted it set up. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Jumbas killed like a real pro. She commissioned the heist, not me. No, you're the one who fucked it up. You weren't there. You don't know Jack. That shit went sideways. I... Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Okay, let's just say I'm pretty much fucked. Biochip you clip during the heist is killing me. Albeit slowly. Evie commissioned the job. I know how to stop that. That's why I need to know who hired her. Huh. Let's say I believe you. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. I'd look for her there. Where is that? Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it, and once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Okay. Maggot's hour. Luxurious. Thanks, Judy. Wait. Oh. Um. Just let me know how she's doing. Okay. Give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. Judy's chill. He'll help her out. Ooh. I'll take a free gun. We already looted back here. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram in a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? The freaking back and forth between <laughs> between you and him is just insane. It is a wild story. Forget Evelyn. Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. She cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. She's pretty good. Alright. The ones that she showed me, were, that was crazy. Alright. Go to the afterlife. Oh, we have to go. Mega building H8. So this is where Evelyn is. Way down here. But we don't even have a car. And the gig is down here. That's going to be uh, quite the hoof. Quite the hoofing. Talk to the cops. Oh, I did not want to. I don't want to take a picture of myself. So we're here. Regina Jones. Man, there's so much in this game. Okay. I'm gonna wanna do so many side things. Be bad. Um 
Do we want to fast travel? Maybe we'll go down to the afterlife too. Until we get a car, because that's so far away. That's going to be quite the hoof. Quite the foot, foot traffic over there. Because what's the distance? 900 meters? Yeah, it's going to take a bit to walk. Mr. Hello. Hands. The name is Hands. Mr. Hands. If you're looking for work in Pacifica, I'm the man to call. I'm V. No, nice to meet you. All right. How very nice to meet you. If you have business, you know my number. Okay. If you call me, it's to talk biz. I don't do chit chat. Okay. We need to talk? Yeah, I'm trying. Oh, this is to text her. Oh, damn. She just cut off her phone, too. AV, need a favor, Shumba. Want to hold a clearance sale? No junk. Pre merch only. Oh, that's the guy that, that uh, has the, the gun shop. Farmhouse Collective. Capitalism. End cart passenger. We're pleased to inform you that the technical problem with your end cart city pass has been resolved. Full access to all end cart services have been restored. Uh, heard you're making a name for yourself out there. How about some new digs, too? Dream over at Easy Estates. Oh, so you could buy new houses? Huh. Dang. We can upgrade from that tiny little... little beat-up apartment? Is that what you're talking about? We, we don't have to live in that place forever? It's crazy. Happy together, side job. What is a side job? Is this just a bunch of quests that you can do to get street cred? I'm assuming there's a million side quests to do in this game. Oh. Assault in progress. To complete this NCPD scanner hustle, defeat all enemies and collect the loot. Is that this right here? These guys? I wonder if you can just take these guys out without... Wanted in Night City. Distribution of military grades, pharmaceuticals, battery, or of a public official. Can we take these guys out without, uh... The police care? Oh my god. Chill out! Okay, we got rocked. I wasn't ready. I was just trying to inspect them. I think the SMG is better than... Okay. Maybe this isn't the the thing, but we're gonna we're gonna take these guys out. Or maybe it is. Oh yeah, this SMG is way out. Get our heel going. I love this job. 
the kickback on this thing is nuts. Finally, someone I can fucking fight. Nice, okay. Was that the assault in progress? Yeah. Okay. So the components are heard for making stuff, that's cool. Archive conversation. Mm. Hey, got a job, spill. So I wonder if those just pop up randomly. There's so much we gotta learn still about this. Ghost town. We were gonna go over to, um... Afterlife. That was the plan. That's the other, the other request was like, way far away. We don't have our car back yet, so let's hope it. It's cool that you can just take out like the uh, the people that are wanted. Man, not having a car is no fun. The city is so massive. <laughs> well, let's not get hit by a car. Done that plenty. I had a fast travel over here. Oh, that was, well, you know. Now we know. Now we know. Into the afterlife. I thought I didn't. How's things? How's things? Aw. You didn't want to be my friend. Get you anything? Oh wait, yeah, let's, uh, cause, um, Jackie passed, and he wanted a drink here. Shouldn't mind a new spot on the menu here. A chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. And a splash of love. That's right. In the drink's name. Jackie Wells. Damn. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is Poor already. Jackie. Alright, well, let's grab Definitely one. Definitely go for a drink. Tough day? I don't like any other. Let's grab a Jackie Wells. So, what'll it be? Is it actually in here? Bunk monkey? Johnny Silverhand.
Do they not have it? David Martinez? Damn, really? I can't get a Jackie Wells. Maybe it'll be on there when we come back or something. That sucks. Thanks. No problem. Just holler if you need anything. No. This trouble? The net around me? You won't. You know it. I lost everything. Let me be you. Lane. Again. Solve your own problems. Clean up your own shit. Go fuck yourself. Damn. Be careful who you bargain with. Rogue, wanted to talk. It's okay. She's just gonna let me come talk to the damn. We must have a name for ourselves already. Not here, not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years. It's oh really shit, John. Fucking Rogue, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her. She's got MRIs. See right through you. Give her the truth. Need your services. Got to track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn. Jackie Wells, Tipa. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck. Damn, she knows everything. There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Oh, she's the one that was at the the helicopter with Johnny. Okay. That I'm, that makes sense now. It all makes sense. You got Johnny killed? Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our Arasaka Tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got balls on you, boy. Don't like that on everybody, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Damn. Okay. Well, we uh, we spent all our money paying back Vic, so we're gonna have to make some money. Uh huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day. No, more like come back when you do. Them's the breaks. Mm hmm. Then see you. All right. Soon. Dang. You know where to find me. We gotta make some money. I guess we'll go do some odd jobs. I mean, I guess we have some, we have some stuff we can s we level. Um, we have some stuff we can sell. We can keep going to the body. Get this up to nine. When using blood pump cy cyberware or a health item, 100% mitigation chance. Uh, grants a chance to reduce incoming damage. Okay. That's interesting. Gives you like damage reduction after you heal. Uh, that is more health regen the lower your health is. This is just health regen while you're sprinting and this is for each enemy nearby. Hmm. And then there's there's always the car thing that you can get. 50% damage of enemy vehicles and their occupants. Dang. Do you just ram people with your car? That's crazy. The uh this one seems pretty good. The extra health regen. 
Let's see what else we can get, though. Effective range and accuracy. That'd be really good. Weapon swap speed. Eh. No, that wouldn't be that bad. We switch back and forth a lot between the SMG and the assault rifle. Power slide. Oh, this is what we wanted to the shooting while while sprinting and sliding and stuff. That'd be cool. That would have been useful. And then all of this like health regen stuff is really good too. We're taking so much damage from people because of the hard difficulty. It's kind of kind of crazy. Let's just grab this. The health regen. Damn. Hey, interested in some work? So are the green things people you can talk to? The green spots? Doing what? On the minimap? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? You want to run this by a fixer first. Fuck the middleman. They're cash drains. Attitude like that won't get you far in this line of work. I don't need a consultant. I need a transporter. Will you do it or not? Yeah, everyone hates having fixers. I guess it just costs more money, though. I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Yeah, everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty free. Duty free and detail free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? I mean, we gotta make some money somehow. Yeah, sure, I mean. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. We gotta Head find to money the somehow. Waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Till then, I guess. Okay. This guy's just straight up cyberware. Welcome to Night City. That's wild. What was this quest? Um, that's the boxing thing. Oh, I guess we could also go collect our. Well, that's way across town. What the heck is this quest? Big in Japan. This is the one, right? Find the package delivered from A to B. Yeah. Oh, this is way. Way far away too, but maybe we have a, a fast travel over there. Way up here. Well, we can get closer. That's not that bad. Oh, do we get all the fast travels here? Nice. In the first area, at least. That's good. This map, though, is massive, and I feel like it's just going to get bigger. We sell some stuff quick, too. Is this katana good? Tier 2. 40 damage.
We gotta, we gotta learn how to do the upgrades and stuff. Is that just in here? Crafting? Oh, okay. So you can just make... Tier 3. But it takes the components. Okay, so that takes Tier 3 item components. This takes Tier 2. Oh, well, these are Tier 1s. Okay, and you can upgrade... You can upgrade components up to... Is that right? Or can you just downgrade? Oh, you can craft better ones with, with, uh, tier twos. Okay. Okay. So no matter what, if you collect a bunch of low ones, you can up them. Or maybe it's just tier twos. That's good to know. You can make scopes. Upgrades. Oh, here we go. But you can't upgrade these ones. Right? Locked. Hmm. Is it because it's a named thing? Oh, it just, no, it just takes a ton. Okay. I see now. So why can't we upgrade, um... Those ones that we have. Like these. Why can't these be upgraded? Oh, we don't want damage reduction. Those are just silencers. We don't need silencers. We're not trying to be sneaky. Whoa, what is this? These are just mods that- oh, okay. Oh, these are our abilities. The reboot, short circuit. Okay, so we'll get different ones that we can put in here. And this is just- shows that, okay. Cool. And then we have different grenades that we can use. And different healing things that we can use. There's so much to this game that we got. That we gotta unpack and learn. Alright. <laughs> he walked into me, man. I'm sorry. Alright. Let's go to Kabuki. I've been digging this SMG. It's been good. Oh, it's a cop. Why is he talking to the tiger claws? Oh, I'm sorry. I wasn't. I wasn't inspecting you. I'm sorry. Maybe he's a crooked cop. Well, this is where we're supposed to go. Like the slums. Somewhere down here, there's a a fridge that we're looking for. Why? 
Why am I being shot at by these people? Apparently the Tiger Claws don't like me. I got stuck on a freaking thing. I was not expecting to just be thrown into a fight. Suck on a grenade! This is an assault, that's what's going on. I didn't even see that. That's why. Are there still guys around? Uh oh, uh oh. Neutralize the perps. Secure the evidence. Oh, nice! We got cyberware's capacity increased? Is that because that was like a unnamed person or something? Like a harder person to kill? Drop something cool? Birthday president for, Sh for Shiro. Okay, we got some XP, we got some money, some street cred. Oh, is that a fridge? That's what we're looking for? No. No future is graffitied on it. Okay, let's look. Open. Oh, the nerve. I just kicked that lady's door in. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, we're not even near where we're supposed to be. Okay. I'm just looking for loot. The loot goblin in me. find him? What is this? We found like a bunch of clothing. Oh, because we're wearing the... Okay, wait a second. We're wearing the outfit, so let's take that... Let's take that off. What is that? Is that a visor? We're looking like we're straight out of Star, Star Trek right now. Oh, those are one of the the brain dance things. We gonna be part of Frieza's gang? We got a scouter on us? Nice. The flashing on it is really bothering me. But uh that's kinda cool. What else will we find? This jacket? 
pretty nifty looking. Oh man. Now we're colorful. Look at that. Look at those colors. Some tiger pants. The gear in this game is wild. Alright, we're looking cool. Nothing gives, like, stats or anything yet, so... Oh, hey, we found it. What does Takamura want? Can you talk? It is important. What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. Okay, who's this though? Old friend, well connected to the influential. Why so mysterious? Get to the point. I told you once I would explore options, knock on many doors. There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompeki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. You sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. <laughs> yes. Yeah, he could have killed me a lot, so I trust him. Alright. Fine. Where's the meat and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. More quests. If we don't have enough already. Let's uh this is where we're supposed to get. Excuse me? Oh shit. A person? That's the package? Shape, but alive. Let's hear what Dennis has to say. Hey, got a status? Find the package? You could have told me the package was a man. If it was a box of bananas, I'd use the post office. Get over it. Well, who is he? The ambassador to Mexico. Jesus, it doesn't matter who he is. I prepared a car for you. Put the man in the trunk and head to Northside. The address is in the GPS. I think it does matter. Okay. One more thing. Watch for tigers. They've got their sights trained on your new companion. Wait, wait, wait what? Oh, That's nice. All hung up. Great. So this guy's wanted by a gang, and then we have to get him to a car. Oh, we carry him like a little baby. Oh, and there's tigers all over the place. Good to know. The stealth mission. Something I'm horrible at. Yo, know, that guy's over there. He's looking that way. Um. Who is that guy? Okay, go, 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 go. Come on, he's so heavy. Why is this guy so heavy? Is that a tiger? No? Okay, we're good. This is easier than I thought. For now. Oh no, who's seeing me? Oh no. How do I get around them? I'm stuck! This guy's so thick. Do I go up the trash? No. Oh no. I can't get up this ledge with him. Let's get this party started! 
Well, that's not what I wanted. Get down, bud. I'll fuck you up, motherfucker. I think that's rude. There's a guy over here, too. What the frick? I like how we just drop the guy on the ground. It's fine. He'll be safe there. He'll be safe. Oh, get around the corner. Holy crap. There's so many of them. It's fine. Get our healing thing back. Whew. We made it. Yeah, see, there's no point. Why be stealthy? I'll just be brutal. We'll just brute force our way through. What's the point? Any more loot? I feel like we got it all. There we go. Alright, where's my guy? You okay? You safe? Just throw him on the ground. Oh, it's way less stressful when we're just... We're just chilling. Don't have any tigers to worry about anymore. None of these people care that I'm just carrying this guy around. Don't look at me, this is my husband. He had a rough night. Long day of drinking. You want trouble? In you go. The quest is crazy. Oh god. Driving with the keyboard. This is rough. This way? I'm not doing anything suspicious, police officer. Is this truck gonna move? Get out of the way. Perfect. I should work for Uber. I'd get five stars. Five star driver. Job's done. I see that. Well done. Excellent work. Holding in there, all right, Hariyoshi? He's awake now, just hanging Things out. Things that give me hope. Early warning about the Tigers would have been nice. I had a hunch you'd manage this just fine. Given that you're here now, I see I was right. Oh, crazy. So who is this guy? He'll tell you his story. Hariyoshi? In Japan, brain sergeant, top of all. Good instinct. One day, Tiger Crow boss needs surgery. But both die on table. Damn. Tiger Crows were very angry. I hide in boat. Swim to America. Here, Dennis saved me. But there is secret. I killed Tiger Crow boss on purpose. 
World best sergeant make no mistake. This guy says, yeah, I just killed him because he's a bad person. This is all very heartwarming, but you haven't paid me. What the yet. hell? I know, here. May this blade serve you well. That was weird. Scalpel? Oh, we got a katana? That's kind of cool. Get some money, too? We did get some money. Where are you from, exactly? That's all he says. Okay, good. Good to know, my guy. Uh, I do have an ad coming up, and I'm going to take that uh, quick time to use the restroom really fast and grab some more coffee. And then we'll be right back and we'll uh, make some more money uh, to go talk to, um, what's her name? So, I'll be right back. Thank you for hanging out. Hope you're enjoying it. See you in a minute. Alrighty. I'm back. Almost perfect timing, too. Look at that. Look at that. All right, what are we going to do to make some money? Because we need we need 1500 and we have 11. Mama Wells. This is um This is Jackie's mom. I gotta talk to her. B. Can't leave her hanging. Good to hear you. Finally. Been a long time since we talk. Since when Jackie passed away. Call in to offer my condolences. Hmm? Offer your condolences? Ay, Jesu Cristo V. You lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyoteco home. Many of his friends will be there. Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, Alright, well, let's go do that, because that's important. Jackie was Jackie was awesome. There you go. Pay our respects. This one we are going to have to um Holy crap. Oh thank god we have a fast travel down there. <laughs> thank god. Okay. Let's go over to this one, and we'll just travel down there. Jackie was too good. We have to. Poor guy. That sucks that he died in the beginning. He was such a cool character. Just chill. Heard you home. Already. Sure got that ear to the ground. Damn Padre. Anyway, you need something. You know where to find me. Padre's cool. I hope we get to do more quests with him. He seems like a like an awesome um fixer. Nice to see you. Okay, sit. Sit. You want a beer? Wouldn't mind one. Uh -huh. 
Salud. Those are big beers. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Hanging in there somehow. Somehow. You could have come over for dinner. Nuestra casa es tu casa. Mm. But it's okay. We put it behind us. Hmm? I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. Could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. I want to take part in the ceremony, but... I want to do it the right way. In line with tradition. Mm -hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket... That to do justice to his memory, I, I don't got anything. Mm. But your heart is in the right place, mi niño. Don't worry. He's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone, and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, V. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. Ahí te veo. Just a coffee laying around? This stuff is sad, man. Oh, it's a uh, Misty. You here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour, sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just, I miss him a lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well, human. I guess. You know each other long? Half our lives. Grew up in the same streets. Saw each other a lot, but just never got together. Till a year back. Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. Maybe. But that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. But they're wrong. What did you see in him? Let me tell you what he told me once. Told me he'd take a bullet for me. In an instant. Even if it'd kill him. Spoken like a true Haywood boy. A man. With dreams. Ambitions. Only thing they cost him was his life. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set. Well, you, you two didn't get that far? He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. I need to find something he really cared about. 
You mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and I aren't exactly on the best terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on. This is freaking rough. Jackie loved to pump iron, didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say, barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. I mean... Gotta be hanging here since 2020. It's not wrong. It is good. It's good for your, your mental health. Exercise is good for your brain. Love to poke around engines. He was 15 when he first got on a bike. Knowing him, it's a miracle he never wiped out. For whom the bell tolls, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times. Always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. Have you read it? Is it any good? I... I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ufrenda, though. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? <laughs> you said they're collectibles. They don't print them anymore. That's definitely why they're up there. Yeah. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. How come? Oh, you're saving them? Why don't you a reserve strategic reserve? Right? Basketball signed by Dante Gonzalez. He was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie. Mm-hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. This is a garage. Oh, kind of yeah. nuts. Mandela. Mm -hmm. oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's kind of crazy. It's beautiful. It's hideous, <laughs> but it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. An aquarium. It used to be tacos. And taco was? His fish, a dwarf shark, like mini. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. <laughs> Leather belt. Sort of a memento his dad's he used to beat both jackie and his mom with it until Jesus. one day jackie fought back kicked his butt told him he'd kill him next time old man was hospitalized and then he left why'd he hold on to it in case his dad ever comes back it's gotta be jackie's dad old school ganger Valentinos, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire many fond memories. Jackie's got some 
rough past. Nice still. Jackie's favorite tequila. Oh, still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. What? The founder of Sanson Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. Well, how'd Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. Jeez. The tequila seems like a pretty good one. That's like a pretty huge memento for him. The belt's kind of a messed up one. I don't know if I want to do that. I mean, it like shows his strength, but the book's not bad too. Hmm. This will be. Fit. I don't know about the basketball. It's kind of like. Well, you got something for your ofrenda, but we could look around a little more. Jack. Pure and simple. Yeah, the book is pretty good. The tequila is pretty good. Taking this, yeah. Perfect for Jackie. I don't want to take the belt. That's that's brutal. Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What'd she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Jeez. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. I think she should go anyways. You gotta come, Misty. You got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. So, shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? Meaning... Packed my bags and hopped on a plane to Nepal. Thought I'd stay there. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. Jeez. That would be quite, quite a difference. Going from living in like a huge city to like a small town, yeah. Oof. I, I don't personally enjoy big cities. I like visiting, but... I could never live in a huge city. What happened? <laughs> I tried to walk through the door and it wasn't letting me. Hey, it's good you're here. We're about to start. Sit down, please. Oh, a bunch of people here. Hey, V. Oh, it's Vic. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was, or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. Jeez. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. Look, I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. 
And when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying. Make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true. Jackie's arm was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Twelve rounds, buddy. Me mandó Camporta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, 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 honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Mis condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? This this is a uh, a rough. I, uh, <laughs> oh man. I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. It all started when he put a heater to my head. Then some badges showed up, and beat the shit out of us both. It's half my fault, half his. And we hightailed it out together. Half an hour later, oh, we're eating dinner at Mama Wells. Turned out to have more in common than we thought. Principles. Jackie Wells. Best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind to something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Broder, the one thing we can't do is be afraid of others. He always knew what he wanted, and he took it without asking. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear. Hard on his sleeve, he didn't overthink things. He just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof, and, and that he become a legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. And if he's watching, I bet just about now, he's flipping them all the bird. Always wanted more than he got out of life. Rest easy, Chum. I would like to say a toast. Please. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful friend that we gave him. A lot of people come today. Even that putika Jackie was messing around with. Her name is Misty. What? Misty. And she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. You... You sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. So don't get any scratches on it. Thank you. I'll take such good care of you. Is that his bike? It. We get his bike? We that they be. 
Damn, that was that was pretty uh, pretty heavy. Campos all torn up. It's like he lost one of his own. I already do. He is torn up after you die. <laughs> Me too, cabron. Starting something, eh? Me too. Not today. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. A proud son of Haywood. Well, uh, I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Hey, you! Have a drink with us. Hmm? To Wells? Who is this guy? <laughs> I think we might know each other. Gustavo Horta. V. Yeah, I've heard about you. Well, heartfelt condolences, friend. Oh, this is the Valentinos. For me, Campo, and all the Valentinos. Thank you. All right, why not? To Wells. May he rest in peace. Gonna be feeling a little rough. Good for now, thanks. See? Gotta know when to stop. Nah, give me a break. Alright, let's go. We took the shot though. Weird. Pour you another? For Jaquito? Pour. For Jackie. We're, we're gonna be feeling good after this. Oof. That's a lot. That's a lot of tequila. Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar. In his favorite spot, where he always used to sit. Man, you bots are just relentless today. Being awful. Get out of here. It's good you came. You'd have liked that. See the Valentino. Once I'd forgotten about Jackie. Days like this, even the meanest motherfuckers pay their respects. Principles. Jackie lived by them. They's what kept them going. Talk to Padre. Oh, he's upstairs. Lupe's been handling their loss pretty good. She's a strong woman. You, uh, here to say goodbye to one of your own? Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us from up there? I believe he has met God, stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. <laughs> Jackie, yeah. Do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. All right. Yeah, that was that was pretty uh, pretty emotional. It's so so good to see you. Does that mean we can, uh, we have a car now? We have the, we have the bike. So we can go all the way over here. I guess maybe we are way down there now. Oh, 
open stash. Nice! Oh, this is way better than using a car. Yeah, where's this quest at? Oh, not that. That's Phantom Liberty. We don't want to do that. This one, right? Automatic love? You decided to uh, find the chick who put you on this first class. Yeah, this is the one. Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts. For Sandra Dorset. You did quite well. You and that friend of yours. Until then. We should go do that. I wonder if we'll get money for that. Is that where we're going anyways? I think that's over here too. The gig automatic love. Yeah, nice. Okay. Sweet. Let's go get our reward first. Oh, I like the I like the motorcycle. This feels way better than driving a car around. Maybe. Oh my god. <laughs> spoke, too, spoke too soon. That's cool. And it's cool that you can get your stash right out of your car. That's awesome. So we can put these pistols away. Those ones can get junked. All this stuff can get junked. I wonder if, if we actually need to keep all of this stuff to have it as, um... Outfits. You know what I mean? That I'm not sure about. I wonder if we should keep that stuff for now. I guess we could find out by selling stuff and then if we can't put it on our on our thing. Double barrel shotgun? Wow. Oh, oh whoops. That'll make us some money. Look at that. We, we got the 15 now. Nice. Oh, no. Changed my quest. Because I made the money. Uh, Where am I going? Right here. Oh, it's upstairs, though. No? Oh, 
Here, kitty, kitty. What's, What's the rush? Up? You just show up randomly now? Weird. Well, well, who do I spy but V in my humble parlor, no less? Wukako, long time no see. So what brings you here? How many husbands did you have again? Oh my god. We have some outstanding biz to sell. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a river dock. They'll weave you a dermal imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A tiger oh. class specialty. Okay, well, we got a ton of money. Collect your free reward from Cassius Ryder Ripper Dock Shop. Is that any Ripper Dock, or does it have to be that specific one? Maybe it's that specific one. We did level, though. I would like to get more. This is really good. Extra accuracy, that'd be really nice. Or we can get this and get an extra health charge. Uh, maybe just because we're getting rocked. But maybe that's just because we need a better weapon. We're going to have to figure out how to get some upgrades. Do we go collect this? Way up here? Thank God. Oh, the fast travel is so nice. Such a handy thing. All right. Can we go see what this is. We have so many messages. I need to check my phone more often. Doc Ryder. How's biz treating you, Cassius? Lately? Can't complain. Max Tech raided a black clinic not long past. This guy's kind of cool. Since then, custom accounts gone up, and so my prices. Coincidence? You decide. Do you hate your meat? Crazy. Let's see what's good. Take your pick. Oh, we have a decent amount of money now, but we got we got to keep that fifteen. So oh, that's the one that uses enables the use of smart targeting and smart weapons. We're not using smart weapons, so that's fine. Increased uh, ricochet chance with power weapons. We see users' weapon and uh, optics offering real-time data tracking of the weapon's status and a preview of. Re oh, okay. What does this one do? Smart link enables the use of smart targeting. Okay, so that's the same as that. Reloading an empty weapon causes the next shot to release an extra 
Electroshock that deals up to 75. Wow. And then shock absorbers. Okay. I feel like this one's the best so far though, because it's the um to upgrade that. Upgrade to tier two. Okay, so that's pretty much what this is. Now it gives us more carrying capacity and reload speed. Okay. That's cool. Oh yeah, we have 22,000 and we still have a decent amount of space. Iris space. We should probably get something for our skeleton. Oh, Ram regen? That's, um... We're not going that. I think that's the uh, Netrunner stuff. Maybe we should. The net running is seems really good, but I don't know. We'll see. Maybe eventually we'll get everything, so who knows. 6,000? Yikes. Plus 2% grenade recharge. We've been using a ton of grenades. Oh, headshot and health regen. Plus mitigation. That seems pretty good. Eight thousand though, damn. This is just a ton of armor, which is really good. Uh, reload speed and decreased. So maybe we'll just grab this for now to have something. And then we still have the 15. We're a little bit beefier. We don't take as much damage. That'll be good. I feel like that's how you do most of your upgrades in this. Gear doesn't give a ton. What was his free thing, though? Is it just this? I think so. It was just if you want it, but... They finished the quest? Yeah. Okay. It's cool that you can go to any of those guys and change how you look, too, if you just want to change up how you look. Um... Automatic love. This is the other quest we're gonna work on, right? Let's go into to talk to... what's her name? Oh, damn, it's, it's already 10.30. Time has been flying! I guess that happens when you're playing a game you are enjoying a lot. This is way back down here. Man, we just went the opposite direction. It's alright, fast travel. Nice, nice. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe we'll play this tomorrow, too, just because I'm freaking enjoying it. Like I said, we might we might mix up how we're doing things. And I sold twice more stock than usual. So, you broke even? Yes. 
the goods were trash, I would have thrown them away. That was fucking rhetorical. The stand's Tiger Excuse Claw's me? property, and your Tiger Claw's property. You had one job. Sell the stock, take the eddies, and do nothing gunk. Is that so hard? Is that clear? Run your fucking discounts when you get your own fucking stand. Which will be never. I don't like these guys. I don't like the way they're talking to him. What the fuck? <laughs> Let that guy do his business, all right? Oh, those are all bad guys. Okay, well, grenade. Holy crap. Yeah, just let the guy- he's trying to sell noodles, alright? Leave, leave him alone. Let him sell his noodles. Medical gauze. You're welcome. Now you don't have to worry about them anymore. Well, I guess he probably hey, has to worry it. about, oops, about the, uh, the rest of the Tiger Claws, but not those guys. Revolver. Sweet. Take the elevator to the clouds. The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. Well, damn. If I miss this time, enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Our sock and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corps leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? No one. What? I wasn't done with that conversation. So hold on. You take a blow up doll, remodel the hole, and, and that's cheap. That's it. Isn't this where we No, this isn't where we live. No. No. How's that any No feeling going on? Oh, I had to the closet in the evening. clouds where we know what you're looking for would you care to jack into the terminal how could you possibly know what i'm looking for clouds always knows your deepest desire we find it you'll have your needs fulfilled and maybe much more less is not a word we use around here Looking for Evelyn Parker. Does she work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. You know she does. Don't give me that back. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. 
Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. I'm not looking for a Our doll. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. I don't Check think you in, get please. what I'm talking about. <sighs> I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. Okay. Alright, let's do this. We'll figure it out. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. <laughs> Samurai. Samurai. Gotta have a safe word. And saved. Now, bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. There's only one person that I need to talk to. Guy and Angel. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment. And you'll venture into the clouds. The payment? There you go. Fine. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. It's so weird Disconnect, that everything please. is done through that. That it? That <laughs> jack in cable. We have a That's strict crazy. no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Oh, how nice. We have to get rid of all of our goods. Only two willing to spread their legs for Clouds you. Clouds is one of the safest <laughs> places in Go all of Go eat a dick, night. Johnny. Oh, the conversations with Johnny are so good. We hope you enjoy your stay. Keanu did such a good job with that character. Such a good job. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Where is he? Oh. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Boom cheese. Apply, applies the nourishment status. Plus five max health. Huh. Interesting that the food actually gives you buffs. Kinda cool. Plus five percent stamina regen. Yeah. That's cool. Um. Oh, these are tigers. And there's a skull back there. Ozeki. Oh, huh. Hi, I'm Sky. And you must be Vincent. Vincent? V. Just V. Only people who know me real well 
can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Welp, looks like this'll be interesting. So, V, you're dying. How do you know that? Why do they know this information about me? How do you know I'm dying? Deep inside, you fear this. Cower before it. So what if I do? Why do you care? Of all the voices in your head, the loudest is that calling for help. Look around. All of this is your doing. Silence. There's something in those mirrors. Why? Way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not here to analyze you. That's not something I do. I'm here to fulfill your deepest, most hidden desire. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. I asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. You just gonna talk in circles? That it? I can't help you if you don't want to be helped. What's next? Meditation? Something like that. Try me. Just answer my question. Tell me where Evelyn is. Don't have time for a debate. Why the manager say she doesn't work here anymore? When was Evelyn last here? You know anything. Evelyn had her own story before it collided with yours. But I know you'll find her. You always get your way. I was told this place to fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting, this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. This is pretty messed up, so I should just give up? That's tough. Rather let it eat away at me a bit more. Fear of death is what drives us all to do what we do. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know that I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? This is weird. It's like getting way, way deep Silent. into his, into his psyche. Death is death is death. You're gone. Game over. You can't know that for certain, even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it. And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. What I've been through, tough to move on from that. Death was something that happened to other people. Hell, that I dealt to others. Now my number will be up. Wasn't enough I died once. Have to go and do it again. Death's absurdity. The futile struggle before. These terrify you. So what now? Now, 
You find out what it is you need to do. Which is... You're gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. I just, I want to know. Oh, man. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. Samurai. What's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. That was I need to wild. Talk, to you. talk. You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Hell, that was so crazy. Evelyn Parker, what do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you, Barjan, violate it, try to rearrange. No. You gotta Goes now, help me. Or I'll call security. Please. I'm no threat, but she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. In case you haven't noticed, doll work's not the most secure job in the world. One day you're in, the next you're out, and maybe gone. Anything out of the ordinary happened here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Yeah. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. The customer attacked her. I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing, keeping your head down. Okay. I guess we can figure out which room it was, maybe? What did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Gonna just stand there or tell me a number. Eleven. Need to get inside that booth somehow. Yeah, and do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turn out to be useful after all. Kind of nuts. We like played them into it and then used them for info. Genius. Freaking genius. We have to get into booth 11 with this one. Blood. Fresh. 
take a look. Not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. CPD? Oh, damn, so they were investigating. See that? See what? Nothing there. Exactly. There should be a port right there for the doll to jack into. They rip it out? Wonder why. Doesn't look like there's anything else in here to scan, though. Huh. Oh. What's this? Well, that's something. off the handle. Something bitter in the ass. What the hell? It's like she's being hacked. Or something. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. And that runner? Weird. I was not expecting that. That was wild. Authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This dog don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Oh, no shortage of life. Oh, damn. Going back upstairs. In a minute. It's first. Oh, I wonder if we can get a key card or something. Do we hide this guy? Was there a spawn out here? Dump him? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oops. It said that was lethal. <laughs> I didn't mean to kill him. Well. You know, that's how it goes sometimes. Oopsies. So we could have just done this the whole time? Did that open it up for us? Hmm. 
Oh, he left. I do we okay. We made it in. <laughs> Just walking around. Anything. I belong here. The hell? More like the white you better keep this short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much. Even for me. <laughs> Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure. Uh, I don't have your details. Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. You sure you're VIP? I need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Try calling her a bunch of times. No luck. You mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. Jeez. Which was it? Osaka or Oslo? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, definitely Oslo. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest, then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. So he's their pimp. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. <laughs> I don't think that's the right. Skull sponges <laughs> and these dolls. Ah, that's what they should be replacing. I think he. I think he phased through the door. You back here? Hostile area. I don't have my guns. This is. This is a danger. We can we uh, quick save back here. What was that? Oh, that's not good. I did not mean for that to happen. That's not good. This could end poorly. This could end real poorly. Grab that guy. God damn. Do we have anything? Oh, we do. Thank God. Okay. I guess we're doing this. be one hell of a a fight to get out of here though Who are you? What do you want? 
I'm gonna ask the questions. Drop your iron and start talking. Just stay on point. And I said, drop it. I'm not dropping anything. Come on. Well, aren't you the king of fuck ups? You're not helping. Now what? Too bad you can't talk to dead people. Oh, wait. You're doing it now. Anyway, just scour his comp. That just might work. Damn. We're not very good at this uh, sneaky step, huh? Oh, we have a bra. Nice. Perfect. Just what I needed. Just what I needed. Yeah, we're going to have to battle our way out of here. God damn it. <laughs> uh, goods are taken care of. Round of five or six girls and two guys, but make sure they're actually young. Not like last time. Broken doll. Heard you specialize in joy toys. Got one here that's busted up pretty bad. Ship was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Golden Fingers. Sounds like a joy toys wet dream. Oh, I think they're coming in to get me. Okay, well, time to time to break out. I don't think we're ever going to be able to come back here. That's unfortunate. That guy hurt. That freaking jumping around that they do is insane. Oh, damn. There's so many bad guys. Can we get through here? Oh, no, we can't connect to that. Let's get us out. That's like a, that's okay. We're back here. How they took us out? Oh, Another one of those jack points, yeah. I wonder what those do.
Where is she going? Don't run for me. I'm required. Hey, I don't know anything. I just work here. Give me my stuff back. Okay. Yeah, hey, I don't know anything. I just work fine. here. Dang, well, we made it out. That was nuts. I didn't think I was gonna go in and just nice clear the whole place. There. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. <laughs> of course you do. You'd have loved to have dropped the H bomb in this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. Yeah, we're making we're making enemies, but that's fine. Think we'll find her there? You think fingers got her? Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Oh, Johnny. This thing's pretty sweet. I kind of like it. I think we were going into Bonnie. Still. Get that up to nine, it'll be good. And then what can we get into here now? 50% recharge speed when grenades uh you have none available. Wow. That's good. 50% faster use of health items in combat. Plus one max grenade. Recharge speed out of combat. 100% instant recharge of a health item after neutralizing an enemy if you're below. Wow. I kind of like the recharge on the grenades. We use them a ton. Sweet. Talk to Johnny. Where's he at? Is he in here? You won? You tried and fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find help. What is happening? The hell's that? No, no, damn it! Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. I'm gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half century old score neat settling. And I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. Never been recruited into a terrorist cell before. Feel kind of honored, actually. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life. Who can help us do that? 
You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so... This Makoshi, what is it exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yeah, seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to approach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer Jesus. fries, roasts, and boils you, you die. But the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Still don't see how Makoshi's linked to my chip problem. Not the brightest bulb on stage, are you? Fifty years back, ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. <sighs> Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? This time, bombs named Alta Cunningham. What? I'm supposed to know who that is? Not yet. But you will once we find what we need. For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. Damn. That took a big, big jump for a different story. Because I thought we were just trying... I mean, that must be Johnny's quest, though. We were trying to figure out what she was doing. Hmm. That's a pretty good spot to stop for the day, though. We figured out where, uh... Where she's at. Or at least hopefully we did. Um, but yeah. That's going to do it for today. Thank you so much for hanging out. Hope you had a good time. Uh, this game's getting crazy. We might play tomorrow. We might be back to Skyrim. I'm not sure. But we'll be back at uh, 8 a.m. Uh, Central Daylight Time tomorrow. Playing either Skyrim or this some more. Um, thank you again so much for hanging out. Hope you have a good day. And I'll see you next time.